With the grace that I've received over my life, I've been able to turn everything around. God is good because where I used to be, I am no longer there no more. How I used to feel, I no longer feel like that anymore. Things try to come and attack. They try to come and call me back to where I used to be, but God prevails. God is a keeper of his people. He's a lover of our souls. He's a healer, a deliverer, a way maker, and a restorer. And he is to be magnified and exalted throughout all generations because we cannot do anything without his love, without his peace, without his healing, without his grace, and without Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ has redeemed us. He has redeemed us from all of our sins and from any iniquity, and he cleanses us. The stain on the inside, he cleanses us from. From it and any physical ailments as well. He is a healer and mind regulator. And I thank the Lord Jesus Christ for this exhortation that is just flowing up out of me. And I am so grateful for my life and to be a new creature in Christ Jesus and to be a child of God, for He sustains all of His people. He sustains them. When I open my Bible this morning to Psalms, Psalms 55. Verse 22, it says, cast thy burden upon the Lord and he shall sustain thee. He shall never suffer the righteous to be moved. And then we got over here, Psalm 62, verse 8, trust in him at all times, ye people, pour your heart before him. God is a refuge for us. Selah. And then we got Psalm 73, verse 28, but it is good for me to draw near to God. I have put my trust in the Lord God that I may declare all thy works. And so this is just really just an uplift on today to know that as we're reading God's word, let's believe him. Let's trust in him and what he's doing within us and uh, through our lives and just others around us. And God is just good because I'm really blessed because even as I was reading this morning, it's like he gave me a revelation. It was just like, yes actually believe this don't just read it and just walk away from it but actually know that i'm good actually know that i'm a healer actually know that when you cast your burdens upon me that i'm taking them and that i'm going to give you flowers in return and that i have you and so god is just so good that if we just trust him if we just believe him if we get even just a mustard seed of faith if we give it to him he is going to turn everything around for our good. And he is so good. All we need to do is be obedient. And then if you just read Psalm verse 50, all like all of it, it just really highlights about how God desires obedience more than sacrifices. And I just feel like today what I'm experiencing is that the same things I've been reading in the Psalms, like it's being shown in my life. Like it's a testament that um like how I just read about casting my burdens upon the Lord I'm living it now casting my burdens out upon the, cast my burdens upon the Lord and how he is delivering me he is healing me he is helping me to walk upright just by trusting even the little things to him like he is just working everything out and so I'm just so blessed and at the same time I'm in amazement because it's just like you know what what the Bible said is true and you know who's true Jesus and who is Jesus the word of God the living (laughs) the living word of God and so his word is true and so when we read his word it's not just a suggestion read the word of God but it's you need to read the word of God because it is literally showing you and telling you if you do x y and z this is going to be the outcome and it's an encouragement on today it's an encouragement to read the word of God, to pray to him, to seek his face, to spend time with him. Because God is going to give, he's going to provide for his children. So blessed. Amen.